Monkey 1000 and today I'm going to do a review. Shea Bear did the review on this already. I'm part of it. Um, they sent him, well, I'll just show you the box. They sent him some earbuds and there you go. If you go on Shea Bear 1000 you will see his demonstration and his review on these. These are really cool. I was asked to do, um, a family member was asked to, to do a review too on them, so they sent us two of them. So I got a pair and he got a pair. So that's really cool. And let me try to open this box up. Okay, so they've already been taken out. Um, yeah, he's already taken them out. They give you, let's give you, they give you a little pamphlet and all the directions and stuff are in here if you go to the back of it it's in english the front of it is in chinese so um oh well, he kind of kind of went over it with me a little bit but i have short-term memory loss so it's not gonna work too good <laughs> so anyways you get the little cord here and you can charge it it comes in a little box like this. Isn't that cute? It's very sleek. Very cool. It has the model number and it's a Bluetooth chip in there. It's a track system stereo, a charge warehouse. I guess that's what it says. It charges at the warehouse. I guess they already have a charge for you, which is really cool. These are so pretty. Too pretty. Too pretty. To go exercise but they are really nice these are cordless so you don't have to have a long cord and it has left and right sorry it has left and right here so I am going to put them in my ears they're very nice very, ooh. this is the left it's already come on this is the left left no I hear her. This is the left one. This should be the right one, I think. You might have used this one. I don't know. I'm putting them in. I don't think so. How do I do this? I had them in earlier. Let me try it. Oh, there they go. Okay, I got it. So you put them in. Yeah. And that's. And you just kind of put them over your ear. It's not that hard. It's just that um, it's me. Because <laughs> I put these in before and they were really easy to put in. So it's just me not doing it right. There we go, I think. I think I got it now. There we go. Nice and sleek and pretty. Okay, so power on okay so to turn the power on when the machine is out of the warehouse the white light is inside for three times so three times let me see oh i just turned the power off so i had it on so you have to do three times on the left side maybe Maybe I hit the right side. Maybe that's what it is. Hmm. Okay. Uh, do it three times. Came on. There, I got it on. You have to hit it three times on the left side. That's what you do. To shut down, you, I, I hit it three times and it did it again. So. Now we want to try to pair. I'm going to try to pair these to my phone. Now I don't know. He had two boxes and he had them both in each one and he opened up both of them. Well, I, I, we opened these, the one together. So I don't know if what ones were paired because he had already done this video. And um, but we'll find out. I don't know if it really matters. It may not. 
So I'm going to put my Bluetooth on, which is already on. Yeah, I turned my Bluetooth on. So, where'd it go? I turned it back off. There, okay, I got it. Okay, we're going to turn it on. I don't know what one is which. After the warehouse, the white light flashes three times. The white ice blue lights. You have ice blue lights. I don't know if you can see that. And um, it's kind of doing its thing here. Um, I'm just trying to find out here. I don't know. What's it, what do we call this? It's the T2022. T2 model T22. I don't know. So I got like three things coming up here. So I don't know which one is which. I'm going to pick this one. See if it's connecting. I don't know which is which. I have like three on here, so I'm trying to figure it out. Okay, so do I need an app for this? So it might be already paired. Let me try. I'll be right back. Okay guys, so mine died. They died. So they need to be charged. So I'm gonna put this in here. Sorry. Put this end in there. Make sure you, you put it in there. And I have a little thing on the side here, and I'm going to let it charge on my charger for a few minutes, and I'm going to read the directions, and then we'll come back. Okay, so I figured I'd go over these directions, um, so you guys get the idea of how it works while I'm waiting for it to charge. So, it, get, it had a charge, some charge on it. Um, this might have been the one that Shea Bear used. I don't know. They both look the same, so I don't know what he did. And he's sleeping at the moment. So, you, to power it on, you're going to use your left ear, and you're going to hit it three times, and it will come on. To shut down after charging the shutdown, it'll have an ice blue light is on for a long time. Press and hold. So, to, to shut it down... You'll have to press and hold it, key for five seconds, and the ice blue light flashes three times to shut down. So, yeah, just hold it. So, okay, to pair it after leaving the warehouse, the white light flashes three times, the white and ice blue lights of the main auxiliary ears flash alternatively, and the white and ice blue lights of the main ear flash alternatively and the auxiliary ears turn off the lights and enter the match ink state. Okay, so after you get it paired, you're going to hit it three times again. After leaving the warehouse, the modern light flashes three times. The white and ice light blue light of the main auxiliary ear flash alternatively and the left and right ears enter the pair <coughs> excuse me after pairing the white and ice blue lights of the main ear flash um, the pairing connects so okay so let's go on here once you get a pair to um, to do the, the playing of it, to listen to music, you would click 
you would double click for a short term pause the music to the music sorry disconnect when di continue turn off the bluetooth or turn bluetooth headset off the mobile phone on the prompt tone is ding dong automatically loop back when the machine is turned on within the connection range the bluetooth device will automatic automatically connect with the paired bluetooth device you know ding dong sound and to answer the phone when you want to call you press the mf f8 key to answer the call hmm. to hang up in a call or charging long the mf8 key briefly to hang up the phone the call number when calling the headset will automatically report the number voice prompt incoming call one to reject calls when calling press the hold and of the mf8 key for about two two minutes i guess two seconds probably two seconds so lower power shutdown when the battery voltage is lower than the battery voltage the headset will turn off automatically which that happened to me i didn't have much charge there so i might have to wait a little bit i don't know how long it'll take um volume up and down to single click the left ear mf8 key to reduce the volume and to single click the right ear key to increase the volume so you just hit it so you want to increase it you go on the right if you want to decrease it you go on the left for the up and down long press 2 and the mf8 key on the left ear to achieve the previous song and triple long press 2 mf8 key of the right ear to realize the next song to release the next song sorry headphone compartment charging put the earphone into the bin uh, for charging as i did you just put it in the little case and uh it, it it'll show that it needs to be charged it gets a red light let me show you real quick so there you go right there there's a red light is saying it needs to be charged and so when you open that up and you take these out, they're kind of like a magnet there, see? And then it'll, it'll show that it has to be charged. So we'll let it charge. I got it on my my charging component compartment over here that has many charging stuff. And we'll just let it go and we'll let it charge for a little bit and then we'll go and find out how well it works headphone compartment charging put the hair earphone into the bin for charging and turn off the light after the earphone is full of ice blue light charging of charging bin plug the five volt power supply to charge the bin and display screen shows the power voice wake up function if you want to do a wake up function you do three touches to reset the function five touches um, when charging the headset or compartment play, please use a charger with no more than five I think that's 518 output do not use fast charging to avoid damage to the earphone battery. Before charging, please check whether the charger model is applicable. The headset will discharge automatically when it is in use. It is recommended to charge the headset once a month. Do not throw the headset into the fire or water. Well, of course. Disconnect the phone from the headset. To disconnect the phone from the headset, turn off the headset in any of the following ways. Disconnect the headset from the phone using the Bluetooth menu. Move the headset away from the phone 10 meters. 
to do your maintenance, to have maintenance for it. Pull, put all accessories out to the reach of children. Rain, water, and other liquids will erode the, the circuit of the headset. So don't go out walking or jogging in the rain and use these. If the headset has been wet, please dry the headset thoroughly before use. Do not disassemble, modify, or squeeze the headset without permission. Otherwise, it may cause the headset to malfunction or burn. In accordance with the relevant provisions of the relevant laws and regulations of People's Republic of China. Uh, this is about China. So it's just their laws and regulations that you can do for warranties and stuff like that. So anyway, so I'm going to let it charge up. And what my intentions is, is we are going to go for a walk. I'm going to go to the walkway. And when I get this charged and get to the walkway, we will try it out. So we'll be back in a little bit. But for you guys, it'll be a few seconds. Okay guys, so we're out at the walkway. My battery's all already going down. I can't believe it. So we'll have to do this kind of quick. Anyways, I hope you can't hear it because I do have music going on. And uh, there we go. They're very light, you can see. See how they work? So, that's loud. That's very loud. There. Okay. Okay. I came back here, as you can see. I went this way because I wanted to see how well they were going to work in the um, woods, like with trees and stuff. Lots of trees. And I think it just turned or paused it on my phone. And, uh, yeah, you kind of got to know what you're doing here a little bit. But it'll take a little bit to get used to and do your thing. Yeah, okay. It's, I got it on now. I don't know if you can hear it or not. Probably not. You shouldn't. <laughs> and uh, they're very light. You don't even know they're in your ears at all. Oops. My contraption here is falling apart. Hold on just a moment. <laughs> Oh my god. I don't know why that came out. It hasn't come out before. There we go. Alright, sorry. Anyways, they're very light. Very nice. Um, yeah, very nice. See, I can tip my head and they're not going to fall out. Okay, so if you wanted to do stretching or do yoga, I think you could use these and not have a problem. Can I lean forward? Yes, I can lean forward. I think they're great. So light. And this will be nice to go walking with. It's pretty down this way. There are people coming, but hold on just a few minutes and we'll pass them. I have my glasses on my head, as you can see. So, so they don't interfere. They're not interfering with anything that I'm doing. My glasses are not being interfered, so that's nice because sometimes you wear the ones with the wires in them and sometimes your glasses kind of get hung up in it. Very nice. I really like them. Cool. I'm going to go for a little bit of a walk and we'll come right back. Hopefully my battery will still be here. <laughs> so we'll, we'll tell you. I'm going to just go a little ways down this way. As you can see, there's people down there. It's so pretty in here. And I'm getting a really good signal. Fabulous. Sometimes the other ones that I have wheel short out. But it depends on the day. I mean, you know, is it? do I blame the headphones? No. It's probably because it's cloudy out and overcast or something. But, um... Oh, these are going to be really nice to walk in. Really nice. So, I'll be back in a few minutes. I'm going to do a little ways, and I'll come back. 
Okay guys, I went for a little walk. Um, it does go in and out underneath the trees a little bit, but not real bad. Um, I have to come down here on a cloudy day and see how well they work then. Um, hopefully I don't have you too close to me. <laughs> yeah. So, um, let me back you out a little bit so you're not, I'm not on top of you guys. So, I'm down by the water. And you've seen me come down here before. I love coming down here. It's so gorgeous and, and pretty. I haven't been doing my walking because uh, I've been in therapy. Um, since my surgery, I've had a lot of pain in my right arm. So they're working on it. It's the nerves. We know what it is. So that's a good thing. And they just sometimes get weak after surgery. So we have to build it back up. So it takes time. They said it could take up to a year. It depends on the person and how they heal. So, um, yeah. So, anyways, that concludes them. I really like them. They're very nice and light. And they haven't fallen out once. Now I'm walking. Now I don't run. I'm not a runner. So I can't, I can't tell you how good they would be for running. Um, oh, look. Oh, cool. Two ducks going after each other. Ah. Anyway, so yeah, I do like them. I think they're great. Um, yeah, so I don't have them on so I could talk to y'all. Um, but um, yeah, I really like them. Nice volume, great, great sounding. Really, really nice sound. It's like stereo, it's really, really nice. Oh yeah, I'll get lots of use of these once I get back in the swing of the uh, of the uh, walking. I need to start. Um, my arm is much better, as you can tell. It's it, it does hurt when I roll. I'm a side sleeper, so it hurts when I roll back and forth sometimes. But it is getting better. Thank goodness, I will tell you. But it's just part of the the surgery and the procedure of healing. So that at least I know what it is. So yep. Anyways, that's it for now, y'all. I hope you liked the video. Um, yeah, and thank you very much for the headphones. I really, really like them. Um, I think they're going to be great for walking. It's fabulous. And if I want to take them boating with us, you know, I can take them boating and listen to my music, you know, while we're boating. I think that's looking at the water here um, yeah so no they're they're really nice so I'll put the description um, I, I'll have to ask Shea Bear about the, the name of him um, and get the name put down in my description for y'all so if you're interested you might want to get them for for your sports or you know just to whatever you have a Wi-Fi you can use them so that, that will be really great so Mikey says she's out for now y'all you have a great day and take care um, have a great week and uh, yeah I'll see you in the next one bye y'all